contact person, right? 2762. So, for one customer, we can remember who is a contact person. But uh, person, yes. here, in our database, we have a huge number of data, customer data. Mm -hmm. So, it's very difficult for us to remember for each and every partner's contact person, right? <coughs> what we are doing is, when we are creating a business partner record, as a sole to party, as a contact person, we are making a relationship as a has contact person. That's correct. Okay. So, the record 2762 and the record 1234 are is going to be linked with the relationship category has contact person. Person. Okay. So, if you open a Delta Services 1234 record, so you can yeah. automatically identify with the relationships the other record 2762 instead of remembering. Okay. okay. So you can ask a question like uh, how you are going to remember the 1234 record. Generally 1234 record is nothing but sold to party. Whoever is placing an order. Sold to party. Right? Okay. So without know without knowing a sold to party, how you are going to create an order? Yeah, you cannot show. Right? So yeah. it could be a information passed through you know telephone or email or personal visit, whatever. So we'll get to know that this customer is wants to place an order. The contact person information with reference to the one, two, three, four, we can get it <coughs> through relationships. Okay. Fine? Yes, fine. Now today we I'm going to show you how to create a business partner record in a CRM system. Okay. Yeah. So the client details, everything I think you know very well about this GUI functionality, uh, right? Yes, yeah, yes, yes. So here, this is an idea CRM system. And I'm going to opening a two sessions. One is a easy access session. Easy access, I think you know, right? <laughs> what is an easy access? And what is a IMG? IMG. So IMG is where like you 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 do basic uh, configuration and easy access yes. is for mostly like uh, you do your business transaction. Yes, business means the users will access this screen. Right? User, Whatever user, the user, configuration user. which you have done in IMG, yeah. that will reflect in a easy access. So easy based access. on the configurations, the business process, the transactions can be created under the easy access by the easy users. Okay. users, business users, right? So here I'm going to yes. create a business partner record in a CRM system. The transaction code is a BP. Are you able to understand what I'm explaining? Yes, here? yes. Is it clear, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. If anything well, else? Yeah, very well, yes. Yeah. Sure. So here, the transaction code is to create a business partner BP. BP, BP. Okay. okay? So just now I told you like uh, whenever you want to create any business partner record, you should select any one of this category, right? So mm -hmm. BP should come under any one of the category, okay. either personal or organization. I just want to create a Delta Services Company Limited, sir, private limited or incorporated company. So Delta Services, I want to create it. Which category I want to use? Organization. Organization. If I want to use as a person, the system will allow me. Okay. It, won't resist, it won't restrict you, but it's not a meaningful. Delta services <laughs> is company, not the person. So, so you should have a minimum idea, right? So here I have selected organization. Once I select organization, automatically the system will take to you create organization. Create organization, right? So here, okay. create in BP role. In which BP role you are going to create? Should be sold to party. Uh, sold to party. Right? So somebody yeah, okay. has hired the role. Yeah, it's there. Sold to party, okay. right? Select the sold to yeah. party, create it. The company name Delta Sales and Services, right? Okay. So the country is US. So I've entered some data. So here, uh -huh. the business partner ID field is a blank, right? 
but it system and is automatically assigned. Yeah, yeah. If you save this record and check the ID field. Mm -hmm. Save the record and check. See yeah. what happened? So, by the internal number range, uh, like yes. from the internal number range, it has assigned a number. Yes, from the internal number is nothing but the system. We have a num two types of number range in CRM system. One is the internal, one is the external. External. Okay. Okay. Internal number range is nothing but the system will assess your number sequentially. Number. Okay. okay. It won't allow you to give your own number. But it comes to external, so it will allow you to give your number. Number. So that external can be configured, number. right? Yeah, that can be configured. Okay. I've created one business partner record, and I'm maintaining uh, some, uh, you know, the details like uh, what is the legal form. Legal form is nothing but incorporated or <coughs> public limited or private limited. What it is? Okay. And go to the control business partner type. It's a bulk buyer or occasional buyer or what it is. Okay. Okay. From which origin, like uh, how this customer is contacted you, like through from the new system or through internet or what source? Mm -hmm. so okay. that, that was also the origin. So we can. It is an uh, informational data. It is not the the this data. This data which allow you to give a clear picture of like you know how this customer is created and what basis. Sometimes we may download the data from ERP. You can maintain a data origin as an R3. Because the R3 is we have downloaded the data from R3 one, right? Yeah, yeah. If you the, suppose one customer is contacted through telephone, what is the business data origin you are going to give? Maybe a call center, telecon or like a call center. Yeah. Yes, these are all the configurable configured values. If F4 help is nothing but it's a configured values. You cannot create any values from here. You always you have to create the values from configuration area. Configuration. Okay. And save your values, right? Okay. So make a note of your BP number one three star four zero, right? Okay. One three star zero 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 star is nothing but zero zero. Okay, okay. four zero. The next I'm going to create one more record person. What it mean? The person is role contact person. Contact person. Means for the Delta services proprietary details I'm giving. Okay. <laughs> so the name. Can you give me any name? John. John. Maybe Williams. Williams. Right? Okay. The next thing is language. English. The country is yes. It is appropriate. Right? So I'm saving the record. The number is four one. Forty one. Okay. Right? Make a note and slash n. Slash n is nothing but you know. Do you know about yeah, slash n? Going back. Yeah, yeah going back. the system. Going to the root. Okay. Yes. So enter the BP number. So the number the first one is four zero, right? Four one three star four zero. Delta services. Select the main partner. Main is nothing but sold to party, right? The ship to so party, bill to party are the dependent partners. Why I'm saying okay. a dependent partners? And so first you have to sell it, and then only you can where to ship and whom to bill and all will come under exactly. the sold to. Perfect. The contact person also dependent. So here, select has contact person relationship. 
Okay. Enter the BP number. Clear? Yeah. Click on create. So no need to enter any values. Just click on continue and save. <coughs> what happened here? We have built the relationship between the organization and then the con the person, the contractor. As a yes. Person. Suppose if I'm an employee of the like Dell. So just now I got a call from the Delta services. They told me that uh, like you know, one three star four zero is their BP number. So I opened. Okay. So if I go to the relationship, I can see the details of who is a proprietor. Yes. Right. Instead of remembering, yes. right. So through relationship you can maintain what are the ship to party, what are the bill to party, what are the contact persons, all the details can be maintained as a relationship. When you are maintaining a relationship to the main partner, the dependent partner should be created as a BP. Like you know, before here maintaining a you know, contact person relationship, we maintained. Uh, sorry, we created a business partner. John Williams. Created as a business partner. Okay. John Williams, right? Yes. Yes. Clear? Is it clear? Suppose if, yes. I, if I don't have any BP number, how I am going to link that the relationship as the ship to party? Suppose if you yes. want to create a has the ship to party relationship. Suppose has the bill to party. So I need to have a BP number, right? BP number, yeah. Bill to party BP has to be created. Then only we can make a relationship. But can we can we uh, relate the same business partner to different roles? Can do it. See, you can create a ship to party. You can assign a ship to party. Okay. We can be created in different different roles. Different. It's not. Uh, Transport transportation zone. What just I'm giving. Save. <clears throat> oh, still the idea has not been removed. See? So, if you go to display mode, what you are seeing? Two yeah, roles can. No, so, n number of roles can be maintained for a one BP. Okay. Okay. The BP can be created in different different roles with the different different addresses. Different. But the so BP can be assigned to one category, not multiple okay. categories. Categories. Yeah. So, uh, can we assign the same uh, the, the four zero th thirteen star four zero uh, as a relation the, for the shoal two? Can we assign the relationship as a ship two for the same part? What is the need of what is the need of maintaining as a ship two party as a relationship? Yeah. My question. Mm -hmm. Tell me. No, but you know, when you want to shoal to and who where to ship uh, ship to that. Address might be a different, right? From the but soldier. here, but here we are maintained as a ship to party. Ship the to same. Party. Yeah. Same. So no so, need to create any relationship. No, no. Okay. If it is in a different address, we have created a different record. That time you have to maintain a relationship. Relationship. Okay. Just now you said like you know ship to party may be a different addresses and delivery address may be a different. Right. So in that case, so what we have to do, we have to create a BP with the ship to party record a role and maintain the relevant address, whatever the address do you required, and save the record, make a note of the record, and come to the main partner, go to relationship, and maintain it has ship to party relationship, and enter the BP and save it. Okay. Clear. Okay. Clear. So uh, how this is like you know uh, now, now you have an idea about any uh, you know the CRM how we are going to create a business partner record in CRM system right? Yes. 
what I'll do is I'll give an access today exercise like you know uh, you have to create a different different soul to parties like two okay and okay. Uh, uh, maintain uh, their contact personship to parties and build two parties and make relationships independent okay okay so independent right so two soul to parties and uh, <coughs> two person and then create a relationship Mm, whatever. Suppose if you take one soul to party, so what are the relationship we can be created? Like ship to party relationship is required, build to party is really required, and contact person is required, right? So these okay. three relationships yeah. you need to create for another business partner, soul to party. So you have to make a same these things. Because why I am telling like you know what two soul to parties? If you do one time, you won't get a clear picture. So twice, if you do twice, you will get a, some idea how we are creating sure, each, sure. right? How we, why we are uh, re okay. relationship maintaining a relationship has ship to party has build to party has contact person like this. Okay. 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 So okay. just this is completely it's a easy access. This is going to be uh, you know uh, uh, used like uh, the exercise is going to be done by the end users only, not by us. Okay. But we should have a clear picture of you know how to create this. When we are implementing a solution okay. to the client user, we have to give a training. So when we are yes, giving yes. a training, you sh we should know how to create all these things. Yeah, yeah. Correct? Okay? Yes. Maintain the minimum values, whatever the values you know. Suppose if you don't know about this BP type, the purpose of the BP type, just press F1. You will get a no, help. Help, okay. So what is the purpose of this field? Why we are maintaining this field? Okay? All these things can okay. be given in a help note. Okay. So I will send you this document, okay? And... Uh, yes. Uh, the recording today's so just go through the document also theoretical part if you want to understand okay. more clear on this so any doubts just let me know on Monday we'll discuss uh, okay. about the configuration part configuration just I'm giving sure, you a sure. time because you should understand what it is actually easy access perspective okay, okay. so okay. once you are clear about the easy access why I'm giving time to, because you are uh, new to SAP CRM so just you should be familiar with the CRM system once you familiar automatically so you'll follow me. <coughs> okay. 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 Just go through the exercise. It's a simple exercise. You can finish it within a 10 to 15 minutes if you understand. Okay. 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 But okay. You, sh you should go each and every field wise. Open this field Why, and F1. What is this field? The purpose of field. Okay. Okay. Most okay. of the so many tabs are there. For the soul to party, you'll see so many tabs are there. So just for go to through each and every table and press F1 and just understand what is the field, what is the mean, okay? okay. Use of the field. Shift to party and build to party, same as. Okay, right? I'll do that. Okay. So, uh, Mr. Ram, can you, if so, okay, thanks. go through the recording and uh, no, just uh, get an idea about uh, like uh, these things, how we are creating, why we are creating all the business partner, everything. and. Uh, practice and let me know okay. 